Happy Sunday. It is our pet of the week time. Hi there. With Sherry So from the Humane Society of Tampa. Good morning. Good morning. And, and this is Skipper. 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 And you know, Skipper's got, you know, a lot of our dogs that we bring have a story, right? This is sad. And Skipper's eight years old and a poodle mix, 27 pounds. Um, and she was a stray, or he was a stray, excuse me. And when we had a microchip and we called the owner, they said, we don't want him. You can keep him. So um, we did keep him. And the microchip, of course, will be changed to the new owner's name. He's in our play groups. They had children. He loves children. People have come to the for birthday parties and stuff, and he really likes hanging out with them. But you'll see uh, on the there on your screen a little bit. He does have an eye condition, mm -hmm. so we are putting artificial tears in his eyes every day to keep them comfortable. But really, what he needs, Lindsay, is um, a specialized surgery. Mm -hmm. We don't have the equipment to do that, so we're unable okay. to do that. Um, and it's about a thousand dollars, which is a lot. But it's a laser that's going to remove his eyelashes and make him more comfortable. Make him more comfortable. I mean, because you know he's going to live 15, 16, 17 years, and I'd love yeah. it if, if we if we could find a viewer that would be able to do that. But if not, just keep putting artificial okay. tears in his eyes because he's a sweetheart. And the biggest thing. Is Right family, Fun and then if you can afford it, it would be he awesome. Needs the eye surgery. It, it, it would be okay. wonderful if we could do that, but it's not absolutely necessary. But in a perfect world, yeah. If Skipper could talk, he would say, "I'd like to got have my eyelashes." Cash, yeah. and you gotta do what you gotta do for your little baby. Just to help this little guy. What a He's cute, cute isn't he? He's I know. A great size. Seems too. house trained. Like I said, he likes kids. Um, I'm not sure what was with the other owners, but I hate that story. I yeah, just keep them. Well, we're going to have a great <laughs> story next week. Yeah, I know we it. are. Absolutely. I, I certainly hope so. I do too. So next weekend, there's like a little event that we've uh, never been involved with, a shred mm -hmm. And it's in Brandon, and um, the Rotary Club is doing it for us. And you can bring, you know, all of your paperwork for, for shredding. You can also bring your computers and your printers. And the proceeds goes to the Humane Society as well, some other great charities. And it's from 9 to 1, and it's in the parking lot of PetSmart, uh, of PetSmart, um, the, the Pet Smart Store, excuse me, uh, on West Brandon, and information's on the website. Perfect. So it makes it makes some money for us, and, uh, and you can help and you get rid of your documents. Exactly. You need Absolutely. Yes. Sounds awesome. Well, good luck with that. And we have some good news. We do. About Spike from last I hope week. We have, oh, look at that. What a great little dog that was, right? And the Johnson family. And they drove family. quite a distance uh, when they saw him on Fox. So uh, he's, in, he's in really good hands. Oh, so. we knew when he came in here he was going to be gone in a second. Yes. And he sure was. He really was. He was a cutie pie. So hopefully we'll have a nice family that wants to take... Um, take our buddy here. Um, I, sure I, sure hope so. I sure hope so too. And I hope I didn't scare people by the surgery. Yeah. It doesn't have to happen, but it sure would be nice. Okay, sure well I mean, nice. if you think about it, if you buy a pet from somewhere, it can be exactly. expensive. So the money that you're saving from getting it with you guys, maybe exactly. you can go back to him. It would be nice. He's like cleaning his feet now for us. <laughs> ready, ready to Come go. On, we're Come on, baby. Here, buddy. Come on, buddy. <laughs> All right, well let's get this man a little home today. I hope so. He's been through a lot, but he seems to be getting along great with everyone. Here's Skipper smiling, smiling away. Smiling away. <laughs> Eight years old has a lot of life in him, so sure a lot does. of love to give. And if you're interested, we'd love for you to come by and meet him today. 3607 North Air Mania is the shelter's address. And 10 to 5 for the hour. So I hope we can show another family pick next week with Skipper. I sure hope so. Thank you.